Oh, don't leave me hanging. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy VII. We're in the last episode. We went through this tunnel, and we were about to give Aerith a high five. <laughs> and there we go. We gave her a high five. Cloud must be happy inside. Oh! <gasps> this is the scene. Alright, there it is. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for- Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! <laughs> you know, a long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh, yeah? Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him. Uh, are you okay? Because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <clears throat> Gotta look forward, not back. Interesting. I wonder who she who was her first love. Of course I know. Oh. <sighs> now that was epic. Here. Hmm? This won't take long. <sighs> Want to get to Sector 7 in style? This is the passageway for you. So... <laughs> Go ahead. You gonna be okay getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies. And it's safer, too. <laughs> so we're really leaving? Huh? Anything else we could do around here? Or is it, was it just that tire? Oh, we could get on the slide. You, you, let's play some... Woo! Let's play, play around in the playground before we leave. Uh, can we get up here? No. Can we not?
Guess this is it then. Ready? Head to Sector 7 slums? Not yet, not yet. No. Aw, you big softy. Gonna miss me? Maybe, Aerith? Oh, can we not go over here? Oh, then I guess guess we have to leave then. Shall we? Let's go. Yeah. Everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, no, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> Come on! Okay. Alright, we're gonna save- we're gonna save you, Come Tifa! On, also, I would like to say... <laughs> uh... That better be in just my copy on- my, uh... My- In this, uh... Video only, where we get to see Tifa's fucking- We get to see Tifa's hair freak out. That was, uh... That was something. But also, God. Tifa. My God. Why be why she be looking fresh though? Alright, well, we're gonna save Tifa. Tifa now. Uh sir. Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl of yours? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... <laughs> She's great at handling the bugs. She's great. Uh... Uh, I guess we'll say she's in great shape. She's in great shape. Is that really... important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh. Looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his tastes better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. 
Oh, and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. Don Corneo. He seems like a man, like a guy. Uh, you you guys will definitely love him when you when you guys see him. You'll definitely love him. <clears throat> but we're, we're almost getting to the part, my favorite part, that I hope that they, they didn't cut out in the game. So, welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar. That's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. I don't, I don't think we're going to get into this episode for sure, but we're, we're getting near a very, a very, very special part in the game. One part of the game that I hope they did not remove, which luckily they didn't, because it, it's a very important, it's in a, it's a very important mission. The Honey Bee Inn, woohoo! But I think they did remove some stuff, but I'm not completely sure until we, until we visited that this one particular place. <coughs> uh. You guys will see. But uh, what can we do? Oh, the, the kids here. How do you like a oh. Dude, what the heck? Cloud, I will go wherever my research leads me, but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. As always. We got that complete. Any new VR missions? Nope. Just, just still Shiva. Synergy material allows any ally to follow the leader's attack and command with an attack linked materia. Huh. Works with fire. Oh. Definitely buy that. Anything else? Just that? Okay. Cloud! I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Cloud, I've registered a new summons battle intel request. Please, take a look. I need you to defeat the summon entity so I can complete the materia. Okay, what is I it this time? I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. Monster bio. I've okay. done it. I've developed a new material. Developed a new material. Okay, what even is it? The fat chocobo. Ooh. Ooh. You know we gotta do this. We 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 have to do and this I now. I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator. Now the moment we uh, I've uh, I want to know. Do our party members? Do our party members also come into this fight? Because if they do, then I did the shield fight all wrong. Well, let's fight this fat chugabo. Oh, 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 oh! So I did do the shield fight bad. Oh no. So I did do the Shiva fight uh, the bad way. I did it. I did so. I went solo when I should have. When I had to do it with a partner. That's a whoops for me. So what's oh, Moogle? Uh, I'm kind of scared what that does. Oh, that's just a fight. Holy boy. Oh, it's, it's little boy. Okay, let's just says uh. Uh, but it's that little creature that was in the in that uh, chalkboard, and also Moogle. Guess we don't pick Moogle. Uh, he doesn't have a weakness. Fat Chocobo. Okay. Uh, he defeated the thing. Not really sure what it does. So. I'm kind of worried of what exactly. Summon? Oh shit! <laughs> I want to say something, but I also don't, because I probably regret saying it. Or, or saying it would just come to bite me in the ass. Uh, 
Finger get ready. Cross Koopo. <sighs> This. Oh, the other thing is up again. Uh, let's do a... We'll just press the hem. I'm not really sure what... What'll happen if I just don't kill that thing. So, I'm not gonna risk not killing it. Triple slash. Oh, it's up. It's back up again. Oh, it's a bomb! Oh, it took form of bomb. Is the Moogle Sony that? No holding back. Yeah. Probably... I think it probably is. <clears throat> oh! Oh! Okay. So fire... is a good... What, or is a good spell to use against it. Okay. Maybe there we go, we got staggered. Uh, I well, probably want to use triple slash here. One more shot. Another triple slash here. Go on. Then want to use have a uh, Eric heal me. Scare's going way faster. I'm kind of worried what exactly is going to happen later on in this fight. Okay, now we can summon. Oh, do we? You know what? We're gonna summon. We're gonna summon Shiva. We're gonna summon Shiva this time because we have not seen her yet. So let's do that really quickly. Come on out, Shiva. <clears throat> there she is. That son of a bitch. Heavenly strike. Oh, I want to get that other thing. There we go. Do another heavenly strike against it. Bombs away. Is that it? No, that's not its ultimate. But it is a giant bomb, so I don't want to. Pay attention. Also, now that I'm under here, let's use fire up. There we go. Come on, Eric. Uh, icicle. Let's see what that does. But how long does this thing stay up? I guess it can stay up longer than it should. Oh, also more Moogles are spawning in. Oh, okay. Okay, so I understand this dies now. Okay, I probably don't want to mess with the chocobo yet, just yet. Because I probably want to deal with these little guys first. Because I can see them getting in my way. There we go. Okay. Diamond dust stole. Okay, it looks like we got rid of them. Thank you, Shiva. And this is gonna stagger it, I'm pretty sure. There we go. Now I just gotta hope I get my limit break up so I can do it a ton of damage. I really hope I do get it. Also, probably gonna use. I think heal up a bit. Uh, this order. This is not bad. Here we go. So close, so close, so close. Alright, so... More of these fuckers spawned in. Man, these are... Oh, it's a cactar! What's a cactar doing here? What the? Uh, let me. No, where where did where did cactar go? Did I miss a cactar? Damn it! That's a pretty rare enemy. I'm pretty sure. 
God damn it, I wanted to assess that cactuar. Get in my data. Alright, let's try the birds. We're really close to our limit break, so that's a that's cool. Also, we, I don't want to do this. Okay. Alright, let's do this really quickly. Not that, not that, not that. Bombs away. Uh, no thank you. Uh, let's do... Get the storm. Then, let's use... Fuck, I don't have it. Alright, let's just climb up. Aerith, can you use any strong spells? No? Okay, just use thunder then. I'm still close to my limit break. Uh, use another fire here. So close. Like he's really close to being staggered. There we go. And now, we can do this. Boom. Boom. First try. Was never in doubt. I don't know why this fight was so much easier than the Nishiro fight. Amazing work, Cloud. This is incontrovertible proof that the universe has a sense of humor. Now that you have a fun new partner in Fat Chocobo, you can work together to squash Shinra like a bug. Nice! We got our Chocobo boys. And also, let's look at the new material that we were able to get. Increases the effectiveness of my- Oh! Oh! Yes! Yes, please. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Thank you, sir. That's a pretty good material, I would think. I would at least think that's a good material. Johnny? Where's Johnny? Uh... Hey, what? Okay, I was going down here. Uh, where are you, you son of a bitch? Can you hear? Oh, this is where it begins. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure we can't do this yet, so I'll come back to that. But where's Johnny? I heard... If you guys don't remember Johnny, he was in early in the episode and he got in trouble and we had to save him before he spilled the beans about, uh... About, uh, what's it called? About our group. <clears throat> that's not Johnny. I mean, that's not Johnny. Where's the jukebox? Or is it just the person singing? Thank you! I signed with Shina Records a while back, but I'm still looking for my first big hit. It's been seven years now. Not easy, but you gotta do what you love. And I love to sing. This is a new song of mine. Maybe it'll be that number one. <coughs> Midgar Blues. Right. More dark mini games. Uh, person sleeping. I'm not gonna deal with that because I feel like it's gonna activate a side quest or something. Oh, wait, no, there it is. There's. Okay. There's the optional thing. I'm pretty sure that's going to lead us to Johnny, so... Uh, let's go over there really quickly. Let's head to this optional route. If I'm reading the map correctly, we should be going down here. Okay, I'm stuck right here. Excuse me, people. There he is! Hey, Johnny. I don't know how to help you heard you from all the way there. not to enter, that is the question! Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? <laughs> I knew it! Let me guess. After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-loathing. But it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up! I don't care! Keep us here! Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her! <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny! Your Tifa needs you! Tifa, I'm coming, baby! Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. 
Alrighty then. Is this what I think it is? <gasps> the honeybee. Okay, so we can't go. We can't go in there yet. As much as I want to go in there to do this very special scene, we can't do. We can't go in there yet. Also, look to here. A secret passageway. I wonder what could be over here. Marlita's the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth, and I dare end. It's always best to be prepared for the worst, wouldn't you agree? Okay, can you guys move out of the way for me? Quality monster insurance is more essential than ever. Can you guys move out of the way? I want to get the item. Okay, I guess we have to go here later on. No way! Is Sarah with us? Or is she waiting? Oh, she's waiting out there. Okay, good for you. Good for you, Aerith. Don't want you going back here. So, uh, as much as we can explore here, here. You, don't even have a ticket. Uh, you know what? Let's continue exploring this place. Or, okay. Didn't mean to go in here, but I might as well check out what's back here. Hello. <gasps> Wait a minute. Uh, what? Uh, aren't you that? Leaf House? Uh, hey! What the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Uh, well, if you must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? Alrighty then. Did not mean to see you in this way, but stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands a lifetime. Okay. Uh Aerith, you do not know what you do not want to know who's back there. Okay, uh Let's go up here. Where does this lead us? Just back up here? Alright. This is where I wanted to go. Or no. Oh, this is not where I wanted to go, but hello. I can't believe I bought the same disc twice. Uh, excuse me, sir. If you like, you can have it. Thank you. I know she's not supposed to see okay, this is like a... So just a... Uh, <clears throat> bar, probably. God, this this city is so big. Or this... This place is so big. You could really get lost here. Okay, uh... Alright, I can see getting lost here at times. Alright, well, let's uh, check over here. Let's check with the weapon de weapons dealer before we head to the main quest. Actually, it's it's on our way to the main quest, so... Uh, let's see. What do you have for sales, dude? Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. What do you have to sell? Oh, okay. Our next sword. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Well, the only thing I want is the sword. The hard edge here. It's pretty much all I want. Do I have anything, it's, anything to sell? Uh, we can sell this. The star bracelet, because no one's gonna wear that. I'm not gonna give anyone this. And yeah, pretty much that's it. Any accessories we can sell? The boots. We can sell the protective boots, but I'm not sure. Any material I don't need? Uh, no, I, I kind of need them. Anything else here I can sell? Nope. Okay. Do come again. Uh, okay. That's pretty much all. Unless what's in here I can go in there yet. Uh, so other than that, there's not really much to explore right now, or not much to do for right now. So I guess we might as well head up here then. Check it out. Oh. Uh... I think we might have found our man, and he's a gaudy one. Yeah. 
definitely. Uh, what's over here? Oh, an item. Give me some money. Hey! It's probably to just, uh... It's probably buy the items. Let's... Can we head over here? And if so, I want to do some exploring over here, actually. It'd be a plus if we fight some enemies, because I really need some gil right now. Especially to buy that sword. So if there are any enemies out here, I'll be gladly to fight you. Because I want me some new weapons. Just this dead end. Yeah, this dead end. The avalanche. With avalanche running there. Right. I think that was also in the original game. I'm not sure. Can we get that head down here? Of course it's locked. Actually, I'm pretty sure I know what where, uh, what this is for, if I remember correctly. Which I'm pretty sure we're gonna do that thing, so... <clears throat> oh, is that materia? Or is that just some lighting? It's just some lighting. Okay. I was gonna say, how the hell are we gonna access that? Maybe we can't even go over there. But it was just some lights. So, let's continue on our way to this thing. But before that, we do some minor exploration. I really don't want to miss anything that could be useful. Gil, please. Ether. Eh, that's that's pretty good still. I would really love it if it gave me some gill. If the game gave me a lot of gill right now. Especially by that sword. Alrighty. Well, I guess we're going to do this. Let's see how this goes. Just going inside. Are these the guys? Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the dumb's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute, it's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. This is it. Alrighty. The mission has begun. The most important mission in this game. Aerith. You sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Oh, don't tell me he's also going to participate. We'll see, I guess. We'll see if he participates in this whole thing. 
Uh, I'm not gonna tell you exactly what we're gonna do, but if you do, if you know, you know. But if you don't, well, aren't you gonna be? <laughs> or are you gonna have a, a root in a nanny or a hoot in a nanny or whatever? All right. Uh, let's we'll talk to you. I guess he's not then. Hello, uh, sir. You two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then, how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tail? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> yes, wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. Ooh. Uh. Heads, tails, no deal? What if we go for the no deal? Or is it a guaranteed win? Let's see what happens when we pick no deal. No thanks. Oh, not a gambler, huh? I am heads. Huh? Hmm. Hmm. Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But, if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, and not just the meal. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. I wonder what exactly would have happened if I chose... Tails, then. Well, I guess we'll never know now, huh? Unless I reload the game and choose Tails. But even then, it was Aerith who had to win. And I'm pretty sure she was scripted to say heads. So I would have won. That wouldn't have done anything, so... Eh. Uh... Madame M, huh? Alright, well, let's head to them. Let's head there right now. I'm pretty sure I know what this is gonna be. Or I think I... Well, let's see. Oh, it's locked. I guess they're closed right now? But like, what if we try again? Why don't we try looking for another one of the trio? Oh. Alrighty then, I guess we'll head to, uh... Andrea Rodea. Nope, not there. Or, oh. This is a materia store. Hmm. See this Hello, sign out sir. Front? All I got is materia. I saw. But but what do you have? Everything that I already have. Okay. Never mind, sir. Thanks, buddy. Never mind, sir. You have nothing for me. Not a zilch. For God's sake. 
Uh, let's head over here. I guess we can go down here. But this is basically the red light district, huh? It's just basically red light district in Japan. That was the place. Just wanted to see Andrea. Like the guys were gone. Let me handle this. You wait out here, okay? And why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that. You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. All right, Aerith, but. Better be careful. So, where did Johnny go? I wanted. Oh, there he is. Hey, Johnny. How, how are things going? I mean, shit. <laughs> All right, then. Well, it looks like we're going to go into the Honey Bee Inn. But before we do that, hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Final Fantasy VII. And, yeah, we're going to head in there next episode. So, see you guys in the next one. So, bye.